Hey guys, what's going on? So I just bought a new Yamaha R1. This is a 2021. And I thought I'd make a quick video here of putting some break-in miles on it up in the mountains. So I'm in Southern California and it's fall right now. I bought the bike in November. And so all of my break-in miles have been up in the mountains like this here. It's one of the places that I like to ride. And it's given me an opportunity to feel out the bike and just feel the characteristics of it and its handling. And one of the first things that I noticed with the R1 compared to a lot of the other sport bikes that I've ridden is it tips in really nice. It's really predictable. It's really smooth. And it transitions left and right with very little effort. So I'm real happy about that. And the other thing I noticed too, riding this bike, is just how smooth the engine is. I was shocked when I swung my leg over this bike and left the dealership with it and was just riding home. I couldn't believe. I mean, I thought maybe the engine wasn't running or something. It was. It felt that smooth to me compared to some of my other bikes. So that was pretty awesome. The other thing I noticed too was the fact that it doesn't have a snatchy throttle like some of the other R1s that I've heard about having that situation. So I'm going to turn back around here and go the way I, I uh, came up. And I haven't done anything to the bike as far as modifications other than I've set sag. And I'll more than likely have to tweak some of the settings with uh, compression and rebound. This is the R1, not the R1M, so it has analog suspension on it, which quite honestly I prefer to have the uh, predictability that way. But anyway, so far everything is good. I don't plan on putting an exhaust on it anytime soon or having it dyno tuned. It's super powerful just the way it is. And I'm I'm pleased with with the power and the, the delivery of the power. And it's got it's got it where it needs it. It has, as most of you guys know, a full suite of rider aids, which I'll definitely be able to take advantage of once I can pick up the pace here and so we'll have some more videos to come on this bike and I appreciate you watching we'll talk to you soon